so good to get out of the city. <laughs> what is that? What is it? My dad. Just don't freak out. Get dressed. Hi. Beth, I expect to see you here. Hello. Him, and I think it's just weird to run away. If you really wanted to, maybe you could uh, stay for dinner. I'm actually a vegan. Are you a vegan too? No, I'm vegetarian. Okay. So this is how you're trying to make up for it? Make up for what? How things went with your first family. Did it ever occur to you you might be happy for me? You can get a new house, you can get a new wife, you can get a new son, but I can't get a new dad. You think this just happened to you? We both made a choice. You didn't choose me, and I didn't choose you. You ever been up here before? No way. <laughs> I think he thinks of it like it's the place he got to be with you. Is this thing permanent? Is anything permanent? It's ridiculous. You know, he's not 12 years old. He's an adult. No, you're the father, Gil. Act like it. Is that why you went for, like, an older guy? Because he'd already been through his midlife crisis? <laughs> I guess I am his midlife crisis. <laughs> you ever think there's a difference between not saying something because there's nothing to say? I'm not saying something because there's just too much. I would offer you some wine, but uh, there are little bacteria in here that ferment the grapes, so probably don't want to kill them. <laughs>